Hi, Christy. I'm going to download your portfolio and give you my honest review. Already like it, although that really messes with my eyes. <laughs> All right. So very nice. So I think I hope that other students look at everybody else's work because this is a good way of showing a package design from different angles. Love the 42. You know, I can just see, I can see it's a prototype, but the photograph is, is um, consistent. Um, there's not any garbage in the background, and you can see how it would work. All right, so I'm also very happy to see that you're showing the flat piece as well as what it might look in different angles. Very nice. Um, advertising layout design. So I'm not clear what it is you did here. I guess did you do um, all the Clorox stuff? Um, I like this one because I can see the whole thing. I don't know. I get the idea. You do have one that shows um, what it looks like flat and I can see you're capable of just putting like a simple ad together. So that's effective. Photo shoot direction. Okay, so which part is the photo shoot direction? Just this guy or these two? It's just my question. So I, um, let me see. Um, I don't like these templates. I think they might be part of a portfolio class. But if I wanted to see exactly what you did, I would have to turn my head and sort of guess. So consider doing 50-50 split, show the ad, show the template. And then people like me, art directors like me, won't get too irritated by the continued use of a template. I hope that makes sense. So this is how I like to see it. Like, I can see it right there, but if I wanted to, I could take a close look at your typography, the decisions you made. This, I, uh, I don't know what this is about. Direct mail, postcard, and brochure. It's okay, so it's all the same company. So what's this down here? Is it a two-page ad? Let me go in at 100, see if it's clearer. So this might not be a very effective template because I guess that car is right here, but it, even at 100, I can't quite see it. And it's not really repeated over here or anything. You might consider just taking that out entirely. All right. I would recommend um, brightening this photograph a little bit, make the back background a little uh, whiter, and increase the brightness contrast. But it's great to show that you have the skill set because people who teach ourselves software uh, don't learn how to do this. So that sets you apart. All right, so this is preparation process book. Oh yeah, that. So very nice, that looks good. Um, these photographs, I'm never a big fan of photographing on your floor. I don't think it looks professional. I'm not sure you need this stuff. Like I already get that you know how to plan something complicated because you've shown me the Purell diagram. Um, I would just show if anything, show the final digital and show the sketch all this stuff i mean it's a walk in the park for you and it doesn't really mean anything but if you're going to show the sketch i would take it into photoshop and increase the brightness and contrast now this is something else fantastic i love this really smart bright design used a template you didn't have to um make some badly constructed cardboard box. It looks sharp. I can see that you have uh, typography skills. You're very well organized. It looks fantastic. So that said, do you want all this jazz? I don't think you need it. Just show this. Who cares about all that stuff? You can talk in an interview about this, about your process. And if somebody wants to see more, you could show them something like that and then talk about each thing. But as far as the standalone portfolio piece that somebody's going to download and not be there to ask you any questions, you know, 
make them intrigued. Okay, do life not hair. Those are two different ones. This one looks like a better design than this one, and it's a pity because I can't really see it. Okay, so this is banner. That's great. This, you know, this is a waste because there's the advertisement at that weird angle. I can't see it at all. Okay, I think you spelled stationary wrong there. But the, that looks good. I like that you left one of them clear. It would be nice to see that logo up close. There we go. Now I think this is an effective template because I can see the logo up close and it's unusual. You're showing it engraved in wood and it's appropriate because it's about surveying and construction, etc. All right, so what is this? This is website design but your own website. Do you have any other website design? Because chances are they're on your website and they just downloaded this. All right. Let's see, what is this stuff? Package design? Interesting. What is this stuff? So it would be helpful to see what the actual product is. Is it this stuff? Is this a whole huge jar? If so, do you have a photograph of this from an angle so I can see? Is it like a pouch or what is it? So is it is it um, eyeshadow? You know, fabulous. It all looks wonderful. It's all um, related, but I, I think it's sort of missing what um, what the product is. And so instead of just packaging design, maybe you could add a note that says for blush or something. Wait, does it say on here? Doesn't say on here either. If I were to read that, I'd probably come to the conclusion. But anyway, it looks good. So this must be for one of those illustration classes. No? Very consistent. You made a font. Excellent. And this is photography. That's great. Uh-oh. Photography. And I'm not sure why you're showing two of the same thing. I don't think that's um, clear unless you're sitting there to talk about it. Illustrations. They're cute. But you already showed these on that two-page spread. You probably don't need to show them again. If you feel like um, you're missing, like you want to show more illustration, then instead of repeating, consider showing um, that apple poem. I'm sure you did one of those. Or the bowl of fruit. Or just leave it out entirely. All right, those are my thoughts. I do think you have a strong portfolio. But my job is to find things to fix. So keep that in mind. Let me know if you have any questions.